Team Town! Take me out on the water. We fishing. Way out in the woods. Where the breathing is easy, the living is good. And welcome to Larry Smith Outdoors. Today's program is brought to you by the Badger Sportsman Magazine, Artline Barrels, Warrior Boats, Big Snow Resort, Wings Over Wisconsin, Mike's Country Meats, Midwest Shooter Supply, Burger Smokehouse, Delco, Vexlar, The Guillotine by Rutfin, Karsten, Dick Smith's Bait and Tackle, Come Along Measuring Tools, Commick Law Firms, Norm's Egg, and Jiffy. And remember, it's a great day to be alive. Holy moly. I'll tell you what, good morning and welcome to Larry Smith Outdoors. Hey, today I'll tell you what, we're actually on our own body of water and we're gonna be fishing on the upper lakes up here on Lake Poygan and I'll tell you what, the fishing has been pretty darn good. You know, we just got some decent ice here. We always come out and walk everything first and then usually once we know everything's safe enough, even though there's plenty of bad ice out here still, don't take it for granted for sure that you can drive wherever you want because there's definitely some thin ice yet, but most of the stuff we've come across is anywhere from five to five and a half inches of ice. And you can tell where some of the wind kept some of the spots open. Um, there's about an inch and a half to two inches on that stuff. So you definitely gotta be careful. Hey, I'll tell you what, got my partner Lance, the lightning sweeting with us. Hey Lance, I'll tell you what, we caught a ton of fish on our system here, on the Winnebago system all fall and now we're into the winter and the fishing's starting off pretty darn good. Yeah, we walked out the other day, picked up a few nice ones, Larry, and now that we're a little more mobile, I think we're gonna get some, get the damage done. Okay, well that sounds good. You know, I tell you, we're just gonna do a lot of jumping around today and jigging. You know, Lance, one thing I don't understand with you, why do we always gotta come out so early in the morning? You always gotta be the first one on the lake. Get everybody to the hot spot, Oh, Larry. I'll tell you what. Hey, stay tuned. Let's see what happens today up here on the Winnebago system, doing some jigging for some walleyes and maybe even a few white bass. Now, what, basically, what we're doing now is we're just out scouting. My partner, Lance, is over there. And we're basically just looking for pods of fish and checking ice conditions. We walked out here the other day and we put on probably, I don't know, probably about six miles just walking. And there, there is a few uh, bad spots, which now we got a little bit of snow and it's gonna snow some more that you can't really see, but we got them marked on the GPS. You know, and that's the whole part about guiding is you gotta make sure that you, you know what's going on. And spending every day on the ice like we do, you know, ahead of time, before we start guiding is a key thing just as much as it is when you're guiding. So. Oh, might be a good sign. Yeah, Lance. Okay, I'll be right there. Lance just got one. Let's go check him out. That's a good thing. I love it. I love it. I love this stuff. I really do. I'm like a little kid up here. Oh, let's go. What I have here is uh, I've got uh, a rattling cast master. I'm going to start off with that. Just basically hooking that minnow. And I'm just going to use just the head. That's it.
creating a fishing boat that delivers unsurpassed fishability, speed, and performance on the water is achieved through an ongoing commitment to quality and a driving passion for making great boats even better. You'll see this commitment to quality and a passion for building the fisherman's boat in every Warrior Boat model you see on the water. For additional information on Warrior Boat's new V208, check out their website at warriorboatsinc.com or visit your local Warrior Boats dealer to schedule a test drive and see for yourself why no fishing boat on the market offers a smoother, drier ride, more interior cockpit space, more storage, more room to fish big water in complete comfort and safety than the V208 from Warrior Boats. Dalco, far and away the nation's leading boat cover manufacturer, precisely fit for a large variety of OEM makes and models. Dalco premium covers are the boating equivalent of a hand-tailored suit. Not only are Dalco covers the best fitting and best quality, they include unique features like our polis cover lift system and ratchet attachment system, making them the easiest and fastest covers to install and remove. Visit DalcoMarine.com for more information on how to order. Use promo code LARRY10 to receive a 10% discount today. Burger Smokehouse, your handcrafted smoked meat headquarters since 1952. Our dry rub recipes, aging process, and natural hardwood smoking come together to create bold, satisfying flavors that we are proud to stand behind. Whether it's summer sausage, hearty sportsman's cut bacon, or dry rub barbecue ribs, we are your source for top-notch hardwood smoked meats that you'll be proud to serve family and friends. Visit us online at smokehouse.com or look us up at your local grocery store. up to the vibration which usually goes against everything that I believe in really you'll get these fish to trigger. You do it on walleyes too, Larry generally you can't get them to fight when they come in. Yep. But they'll school up underneath you that vibration. I think that vibrates the ice and any bait fish that are up there spooks them down. Okay. And then fish are just waiting, you know you get your screen full, kill the motor, you can usually pop one or two of them. Light them up. Another one going here Larry. That one, Lance? Yeah, this one's yeah, a little better one, Larry. Glad Tyler called us over here. Yeah, he's looking rather. I it marked a little quite better. Oh, yeah. Good head pounding. See that? Oh, that's a better fish. Oh, there you go, Lance. It's nice. Yep. Oh, nice. <laughs> Good work. <laughs> oh, look at that one, Lance. Now, that's a nice fish. You that's, know, that's hey, look nice at his belly. Funny. Show his belly right there. You can tell yep. these fish are pounding into the mud right there, digging up whatever they're digging up. And the water's extremely dirty this year, too. Boy, that's a nice fish. It is. We had heavy winds here before that, uh, right before she capped over. And that's why it's water so dirty. Out. You know, and actually that dirty water really makes the fishing a little bit easier because, you know what, the fish got to work a little bit harder to find the bait. So, and then they're not so, not so hesitant when they see something, a flash or vibration, they're going to slam that bait. That, hold you know, that up again. That's we're, we're a gonna nice fish. We're going to cut some meters there, Larry. I think this one go back in the water. Yep, that's a little bit big. Yep. Save the 13, 16 inches for eating. Let these 19s, 20s go. Cool. That's awesome. Good job, Liam. Keep it moving. Yeah, that water is extremely dirty. Right, right. You get one more, I'm going to the gold 
Cameron. I think I got a half a dozen in there for you, Larry. I'm getting tired there at all, Larry. Oh no. <laughs> I wish it was getting tired from fish pulling on the other end of the rod. stay warm without putting heat. I'll take the heat on the inside. Hey Lance. What do we got Larry? A little bit of Mike's Country Meats. That sounds delicious right now. Mm. Mm. Very good boy. What flavor do we have today Larry? Don't worry about it. Carolina Reaper. <laughs> We're going to be warm now. Uh -huh. Who needs a Mr. Buddy when you got this? Mm. So then there's another one up high and hammered it. Another perfect eater for the frying pan, 14, 15 incher. So keep them coming. Larry's over. We're gonna keep swinging at them. Beautiful day out here. Snow's falling. Christmas is right around the corner. Life is good. Trophy Ice Fish, Green Bay's premier ice fishing guide service. Captain Lonnie Goldman specializes in trophy walleye and whitefish packages. Clients are shuttled out on six passenger Yamaha UTVs to heated ready to fish ice houses. Perfect for family, friends, and corporate outings. Restrooms on the ice and their exclusive shore lunch make Trophy Ice Fish the top choice for your ice fishing fun and comfort on the Bay of Green Bay. Check out TrophyIceFish.com or call Barbara at 920-255-2617 to book your ice fishing adventure. The guillotine. The most versatile jigging and hook setting system the fishing industry has ever seen. Programmed and customized jigging and hook setting techniques. Bringing innovative remote control technology to the fishing world. This all purpose tool will change the way you fish. The guillotine, made by Rut Finn. At Jiffy, we break new ground. In fact, every decision we make revolves around it. The new Chevy 46 Extreme is 49 cc's of unmatched power with a fixed position propane system and over twice the efficiency for low end torque. Or go ninja with the Chevy 44 Pro, the lightest in its class, the best in power and portability inside and outside. The only ice augers built in the USA. Chevy, we put the world on ice. Badger Sportsman Magazine is Wisconsin's outdoor magazine. Badger Sportsman provides the best Wisconsin fishing and hunting information written by local Wisconsin guides and professionals to help you put more fish in the live well, birds in the bag, and venison in the freezer. Go to badgersportsman.com or call us at 920-230-3474. Subscribe now and get our current issue mailed to you as a free bonus. Badger Sportsman Magazine, Wisconsin's outdoor magazine. <laughs> Got one on later, Finally. huh? Oh, that's, that's a good, good. Oh. Woo. Nice fish there, buddy. Hold that one up, Lance. Oh, I gotta get my gloves back on. Man, oh, the man. wind is picking up. That wind is really picking up. Hey, I'll tell you what. 
I switched to a Rapella now too, and right away I finally got one. And I'll tell you something, Lance. If this is the way Winnebago is going to be, the Winnebago system is going to be this winter, it's which be we kind of thought because you know what? Our fishing all late summer and all fall was absolutely fantastic out here for nice walleyes. You let three big ones go so far today. today yeah, right around the 20 inch range. Yep. Right, yep. And I'll tell you something, you know, this isn't, you know, everything cycles. And when you look at the Winnebago system, we have super high numbers of perch right now. We got super high numbers of crappies. And then the walleye fishing, typically, Lance, you know, we don't get a lot of walleyes in that 20 inch no, range plus, no, especially ice seldom. fishing, you know? So it's just, it should be the next two or three years should be absolutely fantastic fishing. And this is our first day out. That's not a bad start. So <laughs> no, far not today. a bad day at all. Hey, I got one. I'm on the board. I'm on the board. Thank you. Way to go, Larry. <laughs> I saw it before a pie and I didn't raise to it. Another one. My bail is froze. Lance, I got, yeah, don't worry, I got him. There he is. <laughs> Finally, it's my turn. And I'll tell you what, I just put the other repella back on, and that thing just absolutely crushed it. Whew. You know, it was a tough morning, but finally, my turn. Whew. I'm loving this. I'll tell you what, what a great start of the year. <laughs> you gotta love it. You know what, Lance? You told me to slow it down, and I slowed it down. And he smacked it. And he just absolutely smacked it. You know that? I Good can't deal. believe it. I, You know, that's a problem a lot of times with me. I'm so hyped up all the time. Yeah. I just want to shake it and shake it and shake it. Yeah, no, you know? just let it hesitate for a second. That allows him to give it a smack. Oh, awesome. Good deal. What do Almost I got? there. Two more to go. I think one, Larry. I think one. <laughs> Good work. Oh, here we go. I got another one, Lance. <laughs> oh, I tell you, I'm getting a little chilly out here, Lance. No. Whew. Whew. Hey, I'm going to tell you something once, Lance. What's the only mean? thing I can think of that would be better than this would be reading a new issue of the Badger Sportsman magazine. Yes, sir. And I'm going to do that as I'm in the house on thawing today after we get these fish clean. Wow. I'll tell you what, our first day on the lake, and absolutely what a way to start that off. And these fish are extremely hungry. You know, I'm just shaking. Woo. Little cold, Lance. Little cold. Woo. Man, oh man. Tell you what, this fish has really got that thing buried in its mouth pretty good. And the nice part about these toothpicks by Cold Snap, you get that hook. I can't believe that fish just absolutely crushed that bait. He's got all three hooks in his mouth. That thing was not getting off for nothing in the world. Almost got you. One more. Wow, is that thing really in there? Tell you what. Just get that. Last hook popped out of there and I'll have them. There, got two of them out of them. Boy, I tell you what. Probably get this last one with my finger. Look at that bait. Wow. Tell you what, I would have never got that hook out of his out of his mouth if it wasn't for that toothpick by cold snap. Gotta love it. You just shove that line right in there, give it a little bit of a twist, and them hooks pop right out of there. Like I said, this fish, look at that one, bleeding. I'm gonna end up keeping her just because she had that thing absolutely, she crushed that. There we go, Lance. 
That one's up high, huh, Larry? Yeah, that one was really high. You know, nice. it's amazing how many of these fish are only two feet underneath the ice, you know? Yeah. That, no, that's about a 14 inch right there. Woo, my hands are getting cold, buddy. Probably the smallest one of the day there, Larry. Not too shabby. Fish out here. Not too shabby, you know? We got our 10, Lance. Yes, yep. You know what? Let's go on in. What an awesome day. First day on the lake. I'll tell you something. You caught three big ones that you let yeah, go, really which, is, yep. which is really cool, too. You know, we did a lot of jumping around, but we marked a lot of fish, but it seemed like a lot of times you would catch one or two, then nothing. You know, right. this spot right here was the most consistent for sure. Got to be you mobile. Know, I got four out of my five here, yep. and you caught, how many did you catch in this spot? I caught uh, four here and uh, one that we released here. Not too, five out of here. Not too shabby. You know, what a great way to start the season off again. You know, and the key part was this, is no doubt using that Vexlar and working the bait. What I was yep. doing wrong all morning, Lance, is I never stopped the bait. When they'd come in, I'd stop it for a split second. I noticed that you were stopping your bait a lot longer than I was. Yeah, a little more hesitation there, Larry, you know. Yeah, adjust as, as the day goes on. Uh, every fish is different, and once you figure them out, it's game on. It, game on. Yep. Game on, my so. friend. Hey, you know something? The big thing about it is when people are coming out here right now, they got to really understand there is quite a few bad spots. Yes. And make sure that you're prepared for it. And we'll show you in a couple minutes what we do. We always have a GPS on us. You know what? In the pocket or on the machine. Usually got out here right now. You can't see shoreline right, anywhere. Usually got both on there. So got the handheld right there. So that's one thing. You know, and the other thing is I'm going to, I'm going to, let me walk over and grab this. I'm, I'm stuttering a little bit because you know what? You're cold. It's getting a little bit cold. <laughs> you know, you and I both don't usually fish out of shelters a no, lot. And no. the reason is, especially this time of year, we try to acclimate our bodies to the cold temperatures. We're out here seven days a week, so. But, yep, and that's the big thing. So, hey, hang on one second. I'm going to show you something. Now this is something else we never go anywhere without. It looks pretty gaudy, but we got some good right. rope got a throw cushion even if we don't use it ourselves you know over all the years we've saved we a few people, people pull them out of the water yep. yep so this is another key thing and for sure one of the most important things to have on your lance at all picks. all times are the picks for sure you know something this saved my life one time yeah not too long ago about seven eight years ago having these picks. I just, I had so many clothes on, Lance, I could, I went through, I could not get out of the water. So I don't go anywhere with without all my picks. picks. Even the if ice. there's 30 inches of ice out here, I'm gonna have the picks on me. So, whoo! What a great day. Excellent deal. Hey, Lance, let's pick all our gear up, get all our fish, yep, and head on in. Sounds like a plan. Wings Over Wisconsin, a nonprofit organization dedicated to natural resource restoration, preservation, and education with youth and community involvement. Through cooperation with private landowners, state and federal agencies, Wings Over Wisconsin has been a leader in the preservation of our natural wildlife habitat with donated dollars staying in Wisconsin for Wisconsin. For information about how you can join this great organization or how to start a new chapter, please visit wingsoverwisconsin.org. For over 25 years, Midwestern Shooter Supply has been your premier dealer for hunting supplies. Our staff is friendly, experienced, and certified with over 15 years in gunsmithing experience. We're your one-stop shop for your hunting needs. Our inventory is at the lowest possible price, and we will match any other dealer advertised price. Do you do more than hunt? Check out our supply of fishing products as well. Visit Midwestern Shooter Supply today, or shop our web store at mwshooters.com. Midwestern Shooter Supply, we want to be your outdoor supplier. Vexilar, always innovating, never imitating. For nearly 60 years, Vexilar has been the innovator to help anglers catch more fish. The FLX sonar technology changed the flasher sonar world forever with the creation of the FLX 28. Now the FLX 12 features a brilliant display and easy to use two button control system. The FLX 20 is packed with features like zoom zones and a three color palette display. To learn more about FLX technology, visit vexilar.com.
Hey, I'll tell you what, Lance. You had the hot hand today. I'm glad we weren't playing your favorite game, Speak, Speak Out. Out. No. Right? You know what? You definitely, I can't believe. I mean, I really struggled there uh, for most of the day till the end, and then I caught on a little bit better. Yeah. But uh, you definitely had the hot hand. You know, tell everybody that, you know, we are guiding full time now. We got plenty of ice. It's time to rock and roll. Yep, the ice is safe out there. You know, we do uh, seven, eight hour, seven, eight hour day trips. Uh, we supply everything. All you gotta bring is whatever you want to drink. We cook you a nice uh, hot meal at lunchtime, all the Vexlars, uh, the poles, and a good time out on the ice. Uh, That's what it's all about, right? You got it. We run pretty much all permanent shacks so we can move you guys real fast, keep you guys right in the shack as we move you. So, you know, it, it really makes a difference in our guiding business. We do something that a lot of the other guides don't do. And, we, and plus, I've been doing it full time for 29 years this year. Hey, Lance, I'll tell you what, what a fun time. Really, you know, we had great fishing all late summer, all fall, and now the winter has started off absolutely dynamite. We got good numbers. A walleyes, perch, crappies, it should be a fantastic winter, huh? And what's some quality fish? I mean, today we landed some 16 to 20 inches. Well, I, mean, I was... tell you, we, it was not really the well... truth. Use was the definitely <laughs> the guy that had the big fish. Use. Right. I gotta look that up in the dictionary. <laughs> Use for sure. Hey, I'll tell you what. Hey, and make sure everybody checks our new website out, LarrySmith.com. We got a lot of great things on there that you need to check out for sure. A lot of extras that when we film a show, we put on there. So it really works out good. And another really big thing. Thing, you got to remember, the, my old buddy Shotgun Schaefer is going to be up at Woodman's in Green Bay on January 13th. So make sure you check that out. You can check the times and stuff like that out on our website. You'll know when Schaefer is going to be there, but he's going to be cooking some awesome burger, smokehouse products, like always. You know? That sounds great, Larry. Hey, Lance, I thought you were going to ask me. What are we doing in the Suburban, Larry, when well, you got a decked out truck? I, yeah, I'll tell you what. I just got to tell everybody real quick. You know what, last week when we were up in Minnesota, when we were coming home, the blower fan went out on the truck yeah. and it was very cold <laughs> ride home. So she's in getting fixed and uh, hopefully we got her back on the road here real soon. Hey, you know what? Again, if you want to contact us uh, for a little uh, guiding out on the Winnebago system in Petenwell, give Lance or myself a call. And just remember, like I always say, what a great day to be alive and Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas.